Okay, hi guys. I'm going to be showing you how I make my lyric videos in Sony Vegas. So first, I'm going to show you how I um, make my backgrounds in Sony Vegas. So just go to wherever your background is. And I typically do my background. I get my backgrounds from Google, like Google Images. And I type in something like aesthetic Tumblr desktop or whatever, but I make sure that I have desktop in it. Alright, so here's the image that we're going to make the background on, and it fits. But if it doesn't fit, you're going to hit event pan crop, and then you hit maintain aspect ratio no. And you need this yes, and that will make it so it's one fit. But in my background, already fits my screen, so it's not going to do anything. But you're going to hit the source, maintain, maintain aspect ratio, no. So, oh, that's all I got. And then you're going to go down to legacy text. And this is already have all my things I already made, but you can But, Right here, and then you go ahead and just keep this on top. And when I get my um, I get my fonts from thefont.com, and you can just look at how to install and everything. But yeah, and this is Diamond Girl for you. Oh, I place it here. You can place it anywhere. That's all my stuff. Effects. Now, don't go to text and titles. Like I don't know, it changes up the font a little bit, but legacy will make it so it's exactly how it is on a computer. I don't know why, but that's how it is. And so you can hit save, and I will save your preset. So it'll be all like that. And then once you have a place to where you want to be, you're gonna hit. Make sure it's the best for the best that you can do. You want to make sure it's like that. And then you're going to hit save snapshot. And then you're going to save it to wherever it's going to be. Wherever you're going to put it at. And I keep my hands on my jump drive. I'm going to make it up. Seven minutes. Okay. And I don't know why. I like to make the title screen too on here. So as I save, then I just. See. And I have another page. This too. And this one will song. If you know the song, comment it. Ah, okay. Either way, I just want to do it. But, um, yeah, we have that. Why is that showing up on my screen? Okay, it was, a little, it was a little slow, but yeah. And you can make it any color you want. I'm just gonna, make, I'm gonna keep it white. I like how it looks white. So then you're gonna go back to save it again. And this is gonna be your title screen. So you're gonna go where you're gonna save your stuff at. Mine's gonna be my jump drive. And then I do the I oh can't do that forgot. Delete. And you're gonna delete this and delete this. And then you wanna go get hit this button right here, import media. And then you're gonna go to to get your music. Now I got my music from YouTube, so the way I do it is that I copy the URL 
Now trying to get stuff on it. I forgot. You have to insert an audio track. Okay. I have to insert an audio track. I forgot about that. So now since we're on the audio track, now we can insert the music. So I'm gonna go to my music and I get my music from YouTube. I copy the URL and then I um, go to YouTube to mp3.com and whatever and then I just follow the instructions. So now I'm going to insert this audio, Ariana Grande, Seven Rings. So I'm going to drag that down there. And then on top of that, I'm going to put in this right here. The, um, you know. And then we're gonna just stretch that out all the way to the end. So it's gonna be like. <laughs> and so that's about where it stops at. And then we're gonna make the media generators, legacy text. If you didn't save your text, you're gonna go up to sample text, the default text. Don't do any of those. Don't think it's one as you can, but you know, just easy to just do this the way I do my live videos. So then we're sample text. But I already have my stuff set here. So I'm gonna do it right there. And I do it two lines when I get onto here. It's two lines. First time I'm going on, so I do one line. So I copy, paste, and you see that representation is going to all those bubbles, so it's not fitting on the screen. So we have to break it up. I'm trying to do it easily. So I'm going to do like that. And I like that, and I try to keep it as centered as it is. But sometimes, sometimes it's centered, but it doesn't look centered, so I'm going to change it a little bit. Excuse me. But yeah, that's how you do it. You just go back a little bit. Oh, I'm going to go off. Oh, that's a little off. And you stop, do that right there, bring down text, copy, click it to one by, if you're short, I do two, like two, I copy two lines and put on one, which is the best thing, oh my gosh, it goes much easier. So just do that, hit the backspace and hit enter, Just keep going with this. So once you completed your little video, the next thing you're gonna do, well, first of all, make sure that it's like listen to it all the way through to make sure everything is the way it needs to be. And then once you're for sure ready, that you for sure know that it's ready. And you're gonna go up to Uncle Daddy, you're gonna go to File. Oop, what did I do? Oh, I saved it. Okay, my bad. But what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to File and Render As. So once you click Render button, Render As. You're gonna go up here, or if you want to, you can change the name of it. I'm gonna change the lyric of the song, so the name of the song is like, um, John Day, Seven Rings Lyrics. And then you're gonna go, I have a star. Oh, ooh. Okay, so you're gonna go on the web video WMB, not the audio, the video, and you're gonna go here to the 1080p, the 8m, the 8m BPS 1080. All right, you can do any other ones, but this is the highest quality that they have on here that you can save, and if you want to use the look really really good you can do it like this but it's a little video so you still don't have to but I just do the highest quality that they have so make sure you click that hit render and then 
you miss me the lyric video will be rendering now mine should take about 40 minutes that's because i have a terrible terrible computer so this is really it after you saved it after you finish rendering you're gonna just upload the 